Something nice. guys welcome back to another video today we're fishing for oh eel so what is this this is my 2500 all right got my six and a half foot rod and my nine foot rod and I got some shrimp and some taco egg that I'm gonna be dunking and whipping. Hopefully we could get a nice old eel. I just want a nice bite today. Catch and release. Unless the old eel is like 10 pounds or something, but it's a pretty windy day. Conditions aren't the best, but what else is there to do in quarantine? Alright. I'm just super grateful that I'm able to fish, you know, just drive to a spot and fish during quarantine, you know? It's not snowing or negative 20 degrees. I can just go out and fish by myself and, you know, have some fun. Stress relieved. Okay, I'll tie a whipping right first. So, let's see. I also got my cast master and fly in there. I don't think I'm gonna use that though. But I'm gonna look for a good size hook. I'm hoping for a twow or something good on this line. I think I've only caught one twow here ever though. <laughs> but you never know. I got 10 shrimp, I got a lot of shrimps today. And I got some taco leg. So we're gonna see. Try everything out today. Ah, uh, is this bait too small? Nah, that's good. Just gonna put some shrimp on there. And I'm just gonna throw it out there. Ah. Right there. And let's set up our dunking pole. My nine foot scimitar. I'm gonna set this sucker up and put on a little topple leg. It's not that old. Maybe a week. But it's been in the freezer. Oh, it's old. You can tell that it's not the freshest. Alright. So we got a nice little taco lake. Around a week old. Frozen taco going out. Because as you saw guys, there's so much papillos, the little papillos, that a big shrimp wouldn't last a minute out there. So a taco lake will stay on way longer. And hopefully we'll catch a nice wheel. We got a papillo. Little papillo on the huge hook, man. I don't know how they bite it. They're vicious. Something nice. I might have been a papillo. My hook 
looks pretty small now. I've been trying to catch some towels. But that was on York appeal guaranteed. That was nice. Dang. What is this? I was just reeling my bait to turn on the camera. I got something here. What the heck? Oh my, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, that's a moy, 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 that's a moy. That's a moy. <gasps> what the heck? <sighs> Wait, Justin, did you catch a moi? Is it an eel? Dude, I caught a moi! I caught a moi, what the heck? On the donking rig! Dude, that's awesome! Dude, I was just reeling in my line to check bait. It was kind of heavy. I've never fought a moi on like a pole like this, ever. Good thing I have a measuring tape. I know he's legal, but I want to see how long he is. If he's 12, I'll keep him. If he's 11. 11 is legal size. Yeah, from the nose to the tail. Yeah, we got 12. Yeah, legal size is 11. If he was 11, I'd still release him, but he's one inch over legal. He's 12. Wow. We're gonna keep this moi and we are gonna fry or steam them. Oh man, that is amazing. Look at the hooky bit, a shrimp. <laughs> That's awesome. Dude, I thought it was an eel, but then it flashed and I went into panic mode like I always do. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. that's a moi, that's a moi, that's a moi, that's a moi, that's a moi. Moi are in season, by the way, too. Gotta make sure they're in season. They are definitely in season. Uh, guys, I'm just thinking right now that other fish I lost, that one bite before. I hope that wasn't a moi. <laughs> I hope I hope that was a little o eagle or something and I didn't lose a moi. <laughs> All right guys, that will be it for the fishing trip. Only caught one fish today, but if I could have it be any fish, it'd be a moi. At least for eating wise. That's amazing guys. I've never caught a moi here. I'm gonna go home right now and cook that guy up. See ya. Alright, here's our moi right here. 12 inch moi. We're gonna go clean him up and fry him. Oh my, that is amazing. That is absolutely amazing. Can eat the tail. Super crispy. That is amazing. Whoa! Hey, Mr. B.